Aaron Wan-Bissaka on the bench, Darmesh. Um, you've said that United looking for a right back. What's the situation with him? It's not so much actively looking for a right back. They're just looking at options, potential options. But it's all going to depend on what happens with Aaron Wan-Bissaka. Why are you laughing? What are you laughing at? What's the difference? You said, you said they're not actively looking, but they're looking at options. They're just, just having a look around, just keeping an eye on their situation. The question was, are they looking for a right back? Not necessarily. If you let me finish, <laughs> Carve. Carry on. Unreal. You still have to deal with. You said they're not actively looking, they're looking at options. I just want to know what the difference was between the two. Um, it's just looking at options, but not actively looking. That's what it means. Right, I think we saw. So anyway, <laughs> look. Are they looking for a right they're back? They're keeping an eye on their right back position, their right back area. OK? That's what they're doing. They've done a, a bit of work on various right backs. Ridiculous. Really. <laughs> like, they've, they've, they've had a look at Josip Juranovic from Celtic. Are they actively look no, at no, it? No, no, no. Or just as an option? Just let me finish. <laughs> the thing with Aaron wan is there's lots of talk about whether he was going to leave in this transfer window. Even talk about whether he was going to leave in the summer transfer window as well. Up until the World Cup break, he only played four minutes of football for Manchester United this season. Diogo Dalo was Eric Ten Hag's first choice. Now, after the World Cup, Diogo Dalo was injured and Aaron wan started the first four games in all competitions after that World Cup. Impressed as well. So it ended up being a win-win situation for United. They had a rejuvenated option and the right-back area with Aaron wan or potentially a more attractive proposition for an interested club. So that's a situation that they found themselves in. Now, if it materialises that a deal was to come along for Aaron wan that Manchester United said, OK, we'll allow you to go because Diogo Dalo is the first choice. And as you mentioned, wan is on the bench again today. He was on the bench against Everton for the FA Cup tie on Friday. Dalo starting both of those games. If they do get any kind of deal, I think United might consider it and then they'll have a head start on all of these options that they might have done a bit of due diligence on. But at the moment, it's a low priority. The big two priorities in this window were a goalkeeper, Jack Butland came in, and a forward as well, and they're working on Wout Weghorst.